Hey guys, Real Spot 9001, episode 6, blah 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 blah, let's go. Yeah, last episode was a short one because, uh, stuff. And I kind of cut out some footage there, so it's not even 15 minutes. It's, for, it's because of the last long episode, which was episode 4, where I recorded more than I should have in one session without cutting it, and I didn't realize. So yeah, there's another Platinum Bolt behind here. Up. Do not phase into the wall. These people can't drive in water. Now I want to shoot in the middle. This is probably one of my favorite Ratchet and Clank weapons, even though it's, you know, just a default weapon. I believe there was a uh, weapon... Like, it was like the bomb glove, except it was in, a. Uh, it was in Size Matters, I believe, which was, a. Uh, I I hear, like, no one talk about that game. Even though, you know, it was the commemorative Dan Johnson Memorial game, kind of. But it was really, it, it was a good game, and it has, a. Uh, the grenade thing that you get off the start of the game is actually pretty good, and I, I like that weapon. Because it had, like, a weird... I believe that game had a weird sort of upgrade system. I don't know because I didn't own the game, I just played it from a video 2000. You know, one of those stores where you rent a game for a week thing. Who remembers those things? But yeah. Um, where was I going with this? Yeah, I really like that weapon. I don't remember what really happened in that game except for Ratchet being high as hell, or something like that, where you got, uh, I don't know, there was just this real trippy part of the game, and the, the weird Captain Quark headplant things, and the, the needle birds, that, that was just trippy as hell, and I think that's what uh, Insomniac tried to make, and they did. Also, the armor system of that game was interesting, not really that balanced, but interesting. Stay still. Ah, there you go. Off with you. God damn it, I keep saying that. Why? Before you know it, that'll be my catchphrase. Yes, destroy nuclear barrels of toxic waste. I'm a vandal, it seems. I'm just destroying everything. Well, I am destroying them with nuclear strikes, so, uh. How crazy is that? Out of my way! Oh wow, one of them survived. I wish you could turn the sensitivity up slightly. I don't want to change the camera to active mode, but uh... Yeah. Also, there's a thing you can do to get a platinum bolt here. I won't be bothered because I don't really need that many platinum bolts. And there's some free ammo over here. Just ignore the delay. Each ammo is worth 50 bolts, by the way, so... Uh, each time I get a box, it's worth 50 bolts, or potentially 100 if it contains two. No, lock onto the plane. There you go. So yeah, that thing does two damage, so uh, now we're starting to see tougher enemies than these stupid Megacorp chicken bots. Psst. Got a ship that needs uh, improvements? Worried about getting caught? At Slim Cognitos, your secret is safe with us. Whether it's weapons, shielding, or a new hyperspace module, we'll hook you up quickly, cheaply, and most important, quietly. So next time you're in the market for some uh, legally ambiguous refashioning, remember the name. Slim Cognitos. The only inspections we pass are yours. Starship mods. Hmm, well, a quick visit to Slim's wouldn't cost us much time. Or maybe we should check out that chemical factory. Someone inside might know where the thief was headed. 
Yep, you probably need to upgrade its slims anyway, considering the fact that Megacorp doesn't really outfit your ship with really anything that you could use to take on a whole armada. You know, you, they, they obviously don't care about you. Also, look at the huge shockwave of that. I mean, I know the shockwave does not mean what it hits, but, you know, the effect, it goes a long way. I'm pretty sure anything that's hit by that, by that will die in a few days' time anyway from radiation poisoning. And the phone's ringing. Even though I am not at liberty to answer it right now because I'm recording. It's probably not anything important anyway. And if it is important, then oh well, I'll just cut the video and, and you know, talk to whoever is speaking, if it's for me. I'm not alone right now, because... <coughs> I am able to record when my family is home because I, uh, no one really cares about what I'm doing. And I don't curse in my videos, like, at all. Which is, I guess, kind of one of the things about me, even though, you know, I, Australians tend to swear a lot, but I, I don't because, you know, I, I see no need to. Also, I never get really frustrated, so, yeah. Oh boy, Ice Physics, the best part of the game. 10 out of 10. What does that sound? I don't know, but... These things are hurting my ears. Good thing the volume's turned down for you. Turned down for what? No, that... Is like... That was old when it started. <clears throat> yep. Fl burninate the water. This recording session has been going on for 51 minutes, hooray! Like you'd need to know, but uh, you know. I could probably record every other day, which would probably be more effective, and Ratchet, what are you looking at? Oh, you're looking at the enemies. Okay. I guess that makes sense. You know... I think I talked about this before, but why does everyone use bolt cranks? Like, who carries an Omni Wrench 8000 with them wherever they go? I like the effect on the music when you're underwater too, but you won't be able to hear that because I'm not underwater much. So where was I going with this? I don't know. Something about, whatchamacallit. I don't know. I ate like three quarters of a pizza last night and uh, I'm lactose intolerant so I'm not feeling that well. <laughs> Even though I just, I love pizza. Would you rather live in the world of Harry Potter or would you get it rather get a free pizza every day of your choice? If I had that option, then I would eat a lot of pizza. Hell, I don't want those freaking Dementors or whatever coming to me. Yes, make it so that the water can be frozen over with one shot. Uh, that'll do, I think. I don't really know. Yeah, that's good enough. And now we just have to reheat the water, and why doesn't this kill the fish inside? Couldn't we just keep shooting these flaming balls to heat the water to lethal temperatures? I mean, if the fish can survive in ice, there's, like, very little chance that they'll survive in, uh... You know, boiling hot water as well. Unless Megacorp or whoever this chemical factory is is breeding super fish. There was a delay there, that was a bit glitchy, and I think I stopped this at just the right height. Yep, the perfect height. Perhaps these robots can assist us. Excuse me, have you seen any masked weirdos? I think I had better do the talking. 
A masked customer picked up an order not long ago. Recently, they received a new transmission from him, and they are willing to show it to us for a small price. Small price, yeah, that's over a tenth of my uh, earnings. Okay, funny guy. Let's just head to those coordinates. If only I had my universal translator. Let me smash your stuff. Nope, it's invincible. Of course. Of course. Wait, how did those robots even get there? Do they have like this taxi there all along? The, uh, I, I don't know. Video game logic. So, uh, yeah, the same episode, I guess. Now to go to Incognito's Slip Slap. How long has this been going on for? 12 minutes. This is a short episode, which, you know, it's not going to end right now. I'm going to do some other random miscellaneous junk and then end the episode because I want to do the next planet in a whole episode. Oh, wait, I'm pushing my mouse. That's why that appeared. So let's see. Fusion laser, laser cannons. You need these, because these are the only way you're ever going to complete these like later missions. So, uh... uh I want to do that in the next episode, so... Uh, sorry for a short episode, but, you know... Uh, I didn't really plan this out very well. So, uh, yeah, very short episode. Uh... So I guess I'll see you guys in the next episode, where we take on Siberius. But in between episodes, I'm going to be grinding for bolts, because I need more money. So I'm going to be doing the races and maybe some of the Mactar events. So see you then. Bye.